A real estate tycoon in Vietnam has been handed the death sentence for her involvement in the country's largest financial fraud case. In a landmark verdict, a court in Vietnam has sentenced real estate magnate Truong Mai Lan to death for her role in a staggering financial fraud amounting to over 304 trillion dong, roughly more than 10,000 crore rupees, making it the nation's biggest on record. The trial, which commenced on the 5th of March, concluded sooner than expected with dramatic consequences. Truon Mailan, the chairwoman of the Wan Thin Fat Holdings Group, was found guilty of embezzlement, bribery and violations of banking regulations in a trial held in Ho Chi Minh City, the country's business hub. This verdict marks a significant outcome of Vietnam's ongoing campaign against corruption, a cause championed by the Communist Party leader, Yuen Phu Truong. We will keep fighting and see what we can do, said a family member of Truong Mailan. While Lan's plea remains undisclosed, the state media reported that she did not plead guilty. In total, 84 defendants in the case received various sentences ranging from probation to life imprisonment. Lan and her associates were accused of illicitly diverting funds totaling more than 304 trillion dong from Saigon Joint Stock Commercial Bank, which she effectively controlled through numerous proxies, according to the investigators. Vietnam's anti-corruption campaign, known as the Blazing Furnace, has resulted in the prosecution of hundreds of senior state officials and prominent business figures, signalling a determined effort to root out corruption at all levels of the society. This verdict sends a strong message about the government's commitment to combating financial misconduct.